difficulties with sorties. Mm -hmm. So let's see how Denzel plays it, and he immediately gets potatoed for a one-two fair dash attack. Yeah, and if there's one player in the world with Game & Watch experience, it's MK Leo <laughs> having so much, you know, not so just, many opportunities to play with Game Meister. Not Watch experience, but experience with the one Game & Watch that actually, like, moves the character up the tier list. Yes. That's, like, moving there by Leo. He's able to use his ledge return to force his one-two combo. Denzel finds that one there, but can't find a second. Oh, Leo! Ooh. Oh, wow, the rare mistake from Leo. Denzel popping off in his seat a little bit. Hey, we take those, baby. We take those. I mean, an SD from the world's best player does seem like a bit of a collector's item, but Denzel will take the stocks oh however gosh. they come. I like that Denzel was prepared for the arrow there. Leo covering his bases very solidly. Good. I mean, that up is basically the best up in the game, like, without a doubt. Ron, if you're in a situation where you're playing a player that has some degree of an excellent reputation, what do you have to tell yourself to keep your head in the game? I think you just have to block it out. Do you have to play this, you know, recognize that this is someone who has seen everything, so cheap tricks will not work in them, but beyond that, you can't psych yourself out. Yeah. Uh-oh. Yeah. Nice sequence off the command grab. The fall oh my gosh, Leo read this man's soul! That is a no-spot dodge zone right there from MK Leo. <laughs> Gets around the area bar as well, so well done from Denville to just press his advantage with that legend, or with that respawn invulnerability, rather. Oh, almost staying in the command grab, but Denzel able to land and get out of the way. Nice dash grab there, but Denzel closing. This is only one for the down throw. I mean, when you are in that kind of situation against a player of this caliber, you definitely go for the cheese like that. Yeah, I mean, you are down like that. You do need to be taking a couple risks, and perhaps. Oh, he's going to set him down. Denzel, is he ready to. Oh, my gosh. Oh. That is a matchup check. And Denzel fails. <laughs> and even, you know, even having secured the game with Denzel floating to his death, Leo wasn't satisfied there, went for that tanner, <laughs> wanted this man's soul not once but twice. You don't get to be the best in the world without without that hunger, man. Mm -hmm. You just don't. <laughs> he had already won. He just wanted to win harder. <laughs> oh, we love to see it. All right. Gonna return for another round of this matchup. Let's see what stage we're gonna have for this game too. Ah, Northern Cave! Yeah, and if you're Denzel here, you cannot count on another early SD like that. You have to make yourself known from the get-go. Yeah, maybe Denzel is hoping he can rely on Leo's relative uh, lack of familiarity with the stage, given that SoCal is one of the few regions to have it legal. But right now, Leo is acclimating himself very well to it. Nice drag down there into the jab, so a bit of percentage being tacked on. Excellent grab there by Leo. You know, shield grab, relatively speaking, is not necessarily the strongest option in this game, but you have to use it in your repertoire in order to force opponents to pay, especially with how safe aerials are. Those unsafe aerials are a gold mine. Yes. Oh my gosh, especially against Game Watch, where everything seems safe. Nice, nice by Leo to cleave his way away from the bomb. If you're able to deal with Bomb at a level that Leo can, he base Oh, he just goes back and forth there, but Denzel did not yield! Very, very low shield as well. That forward air forcing the air dodge, leading to another grab at ledge. Denzel going out deep with the back air, but Leo, with all that practice from Meister, ready and he, oh my gosh, he reversed the situation! Where do you think you're going, my friend? <laughs> yeah, bro! Uh, Leo, oh my gosh, trying to call a shot there with a big F smash follow-up. All right, Denzel, so I got enough of those shenanigans. I'm gonna send you out deep. Here's a bomb, here's a gift, and the key. There's that edge smash. That one move is a mind game of its own. Exactly. Oh, Leo almost tried to call exactly where Denzel was gonna land, but Foresight. Oh, Denzel wanted that Nair to probably kill, but it always pops up, so. Uh oh. I oh, bullseye! And for how many times Denzel had been bucketing in disadvantage to present ex uh, to prevent exactly that. Leo just finds the opportunity. Hasn't even been feeding the bucket. Yeah, that's a lesson, folks. Just because something fails, it doesn't mean you don't try to use it yet. And now you can see that he, the mind game story with Denzel's shield come out more often. Uh oh. And that's gonna do it. Leo putting Denzel in the Anaconda Vice right there. The best in the world, baby. Three stock, man, it's just easy, it's clinical, it's just 
a habit for MK Leo. He will tear through, especially in game two. You know, both games, both sets we just watched from Leo. Game one was much closer than game two. And that is the mark of a top player when you have those <laughs> habits and you're able to recognize them and exploit them because those are two separate things and Leo does both to perfection. Yeah. Yeah, basically it, it is the download happened and it really showcases how Leo has a mastery of 